Let me just say this. When you guys contacted me and said you wanted to do Deuteronomy, I was like, <laughs> oh, great. They threw me, you know, all the boring stuff. But you actually gave me a juicy passage here because yeah. th this chapter in particular is cited for not great reasons. And one of the reasons is for this verse right here, which mm -hmm. is uh, verse five, which says, women may not wear men's clothes and vice versa. Whoever does so is an abomination to God. So, you know, transphobes were around even back in Bible times, yeah. <laughs> yes, <they were. laughs> which is, which is great. But like, the, here's the thing, right? If you gave somebody, if you didn't know anything about ancient history, right? And I came up to you on the street wearing what the average ancient Judean wore, right? You would think I was dressing like a woman yeah. because it, they're basically dresses with like belts, uh -huh. right? Like yeah. that's kind of the fit. So it's like, this is just, in my opinion, a great example of a book written by people yeah. <laughs> and, and it talks about the cultures and customs of a time period and shouldn't be informing your worldview, you know, two, three thousand years later. But that's just my opinion. Steve, <laughs> so I don't know. Yeah. And, and it's so comfortable, you know? Yeah. Right. I mean, of... We should bring it back. <laughs> that's right. I think some 